Are you guys going to get the vaccine? <laughs> Push me. It's at this test. <laughs> what makes Ange feel better with depression? I need advice. Yeah, you Stop it. the wrong person. <laughs> Aw, y'all suck at MCs. You got nothing on me. Guys, we're using Chris's phone because my battery died on my camera, but you guys want to see what Magnolia Boulevard and Hollywood, North Hollywood looks like? There you go. So we're just gonna go get our meal for tonight. A different mac and cheese. Different vegan mac and cheese. It's a garlic mac and cheese. It's absolutely delicious. This is this really is just as good as Sun Cafe's mac and cheese. It just has more garlic. So it just depends on what you're looking for. Here we go. North Hollywood. As you can tell, we go quite a distance to get my vegan food. Even though I'm still actually pretty lucky because LA has so much vegan food in general to offer me, so. Why do I feel like it's that way? And we can't figure out where it is. No, I feel like it's this way. It's hard to tell where all the restaurants are when we're driving down the street because they're all blocked by these. Okay guys, so we're gonna pick up our food. We're gonna go pick up Lex's burger from Farmer Boys. And we're gonna go home and eat everything and have you guys hang out with us and have some dinner. Okay guys, so here's the restaurant that we go to. All vegan, absolutely delicious. Yep, here we are. Hi. Hello. Did you order the van? Yeah. Yes, we did. Okay. I'm still working on it. No worries. Okay. A few more minutes. Okay. I think she called. Yes. Yeah. I'm so sorry. Tell no worries. Me. This is what we're getting. Yes. That's what you thought of, huh? <laughs> okay guys, we are at Farmer Boys. If you've never heard of it, it's a really cool place. It kinda reminds me of Denny's or IHOP, but drive through. They're gonna order some some stuff. Go ahead. Hi. Hello. Let me help you. Um, can I have a, a spicy fried chicken sandwich, please? Do you want it as a combo? Or just a sandwich. Uh, I'll take a combo, please. What size? I'm giving you the Is it a drink? I think Ange is gonna want pancakes. Ange, are you going for breakfast stuff? Yeah, what are you gonna get? Nice. Let me show you guys the breakfast stuff. Okay. Menu, guys. Um, what do you want? And can I also get four hot cakes? You don't want the meal? Okay. Why? Anything else? Oh, okay. Four hot cakes, that's it. And that's it. Thank you. 1947. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, thank you for keeping Farmer Boys. You think what? Did she say something else? No, she said hi. Thank you for. <laughs> so this right here is Farmer Boys. I've personally never heard of it before, but until we move. Hi guys, welcome back to Vlogmas day 18. We've made it so far, you guys. We Hi. are almost at the 20s and we are literally less than a week away from Christmas. We are trying to milk the crap out of this weekend. It is the last weekend before Christmas, so we decided to get a little bit festive. We have some wine glasses and you know, our very own version of champagne, which is uh, friendly for those of us who are under 21. Please don't call the police. <laughs> and wink, 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 wink. So we're gonna do a close up of everything that we're eating right now. So Chris and I ended up getting the True Earth Vegan Garlic Mac and Cheese, baby. And then Lex has a Farmer Boys. Spicy chicken sandwich. Spicy chicken sandwich and some fries, classic. And Ange over here. Ange, what have you got over here? Hot cakes. Hot cakes from Farmer Boys. A little bit of butter on there. Look at that, look at that mm. melt. And then some syrup. And of course, we're also gonna be drinking oh, some oh. festive sparkling cider. Oh, no, okay guys, so we're gonna go ahead and answer some questions for you while we eat and enjoy our dinner. So have some dinner with us. Before that, Chris, why don't you uh, go ahead and Pour us some glasses. I want to do it. Okay, go ahead. Thank yeah, you. sure. Nice. Oh, look at that. The smoke. What is it called? Oh, oh no. Oh, no. No, no. Lex, <laughs> Lex is a budding bartender, if you guys didn't know. So I let's go so. ahead and try to pour it Let's pour it first. 
Okay, let Lex pour it, because obviously he's very passionate about needing to pour today. Yeah. It's so unsteady. <laughs> if you guys didn't know, I actually personally choose not to drink. You know, it's been a while, but you know, I think the last time that I actually had alcohol was at our wedding two years ago, so I had some red wine there. But you know what, honestly, I think it's a psychological thing, because even though I'm drinking a non-alcoholic drink, I still feel a little bit tipsy. It's the weirdest thing. All right, guys, cheers. 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 All right, happy holidays, Merry Christmas, Merry happy, happy Hanukkah, Hanukkah, and happy Kwanzaa to everybody watching. All right, guys, let's chow down. Yeah. Okay. I've been chowing down. Oh, no. Carbonation. Oh. Mmm. Mm. I haven't had this in forever. So, true earth vegan. I know that I always, always rave water. and go crazy about Sun Cafe. That's my spot. That's my number one. Nothing's ever going to change that. But true earth vegan <laughs> it has some amazing garlic mac and cheese. And it's gluten-free, soy-free. And it's just so good. You cheated on um, Sun Cafe. That's eh? what I felt like. <laughs> However, just between you and me, True Earth Vegan is so much cheaper. <laughs> it's like half the price. Uh, it tastes just as good. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're gonna go ahead and start some questions. You guys just go ahead and enjoy. So this is a really heavy first question. <laughs> are you guys going to get the vaccine? Um, I think we are. We were, we're a little bit scared, but uh, there's this epidemiologist that I follow on Instagram. If you guys are interested in who she is, just um, DM me and I'll let you know who she is. She's a mom and I trust her so much and everything that she, all the data that she has to back up the safety of it, so. All right guys, so next question. What do you guys all do for fun with each other? Um, so we used to play a lot of Call of Duty on our phones. <laughs> And that's when we weren't really going out anywhere. We were spending a lot of time at home, sheltering in place, and Ange always dominates and, you know, gets the most kills. Lex, you know, it's kind of between them. They go back and forth. Sometimes it's Chris, but there was a few times that it was me. And that, am I right? Like am I right? Time. No, it was a few times. Am I right? That's the times when we die too quickly and then you can't. Thanks. <laughs> How does Chris and Lex get along with Ange? I don't like you, <laughs> I don't like you either. Well, I don't like your cup. Well, I don't like your cup. Well, I don't like your knife. Yeah, well, I don't your like your burger. Well, I don't like your pancakes. Yeah. I think, how dare you insult my pancakes? That's what I thought. Yeah. Okay. Well, <laughs> clearly they don't get along at all. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, Chris, they just, uh, Chris. They just sit in the backseat all day playing Pokemon. Lex is a Poke nerd. Are you? You're the one who got me into Pokemon. Oh. <laughs> You're the one who admitted to being a Poke nerd. Well, that was an accident. Like, so wasn't you it you the other day that asked us to play the Pokemon theme song in the car? Oh. I want to be the very best. How like do you know no one. Because John would play it a lot all the time. I don't know nothing. <laughs> Obviously, it's pretty catchy. We remember it from years ago. Exactly. So anyway, Chris, how do you get along with Ange? Great? I don't know. And how do we get along? <laughs> Terribly. The death okay. stare. Terribly. They get annoyed at each other so much. They're like a real brother and sister. I don't get annoyed. We mess with each other a lot. We do. What do you always say? <clears throat> you're gay. <laughs> and then what do you say back? <laughs> well, you're lesbian. <laughs> yeah, and I know that you're gay because I'm gay. There you go. It works. Stop it. Do you guys have any best memories together? I would love when I would throw parties for Ange and our sister, Alex. Let's not forget about her. Because <laughs> her birthdays are around the same time, same month. So when they were kids, I would just like, it was so fun for us to go up north and then just throw their party for the weekend. My best memory of Ange is actually seeing Ange play soccer. We visit them, you know, whenever we could. And like... Because we lived in LA, they lived in Sacramento area, Woodland. Well, at the time we were living in El Grove, or not El Grove, uh, Fairfield. No, Sacramento. Mm -hmm. we went. Mm -hmm. um, but that was pretty cool to see Ange play soccer and really enjoy that as a kid. Ange knew how to kick it. Ange was hustling. You and your little red jersey and your little <laughs> tiny legs. Lex, what's your good memory? When I flexed on you with my almost perfect abs all the other day. Abs? No, Pokemon. Pokemon. Oh. Here's a good one. Do you guys do anything girly with Christine? 
That's funny. <laughs> they must have got that from yesterday's video when Ange pointed out the fact that I always complain that I don't have anyone girly to relate to. <laughs> really, the only girly thing that I do with you is you make me brush your, your hair at night. <laughs> Stop acting like you're forced to. <laughs> you like it. He's Why would I like it? You don't like it? it? Yeah, I like it. <laughs> anyway, um... You should be a hair salonist. <laughs> I'm forced to. Liar. That's mean. I mean, I'm not forced to. I give you massages whenever you ask. True. I haven't asked in a long time. Uh, You've what, been working hard, so I'm not gonna ask you to do that. What makes Ange feel better with depression? I need advice. You're asking the wrong person. Yeah, you're asking the wrong person. <laughs> I feel like you've been doing okay though. Do you have any tips for somebody else that might be dealing with a lot? Like maybe going out for a run, like what would you say? I'd say go get a friend. That's a good idea. Try to be around someone that makes you feel good. All right, cool. Okay. That's good. Um, do you guys have the same parents? We have the same madre. Pero no on the padre. But, however, I do think of my stepdad as my dad. So, yes, we do have the same parents. What's the age gap between Lex and Ange? Four years. Really? What year? Okay, 2000, yeah, 2000, 2004. 2000. Really, it's like three years and eight months. Dang, accurate. Six months. So, you did that calculation Two hours. real quick. Ange is a quick calculator. <laughs> oh, that's a random fact. Ange was a mathlete. Can you guys believe it? Oh, y'all suck at MCs. Ain't got nothing on me. You can't touch Kevin G. I'm a mathlete. Forget what you heard. I'm on. I was about to keep going. Mm -hmm. Don't ask me how I know that. It's because I'm gay. <laughs> Like watching Mean Girls. Yes. Stop it. Chris is actually really good about watching all the chick flicks with me too. These two. Both of these guys are. No. Oh, you trying to play cool now. Didn't you want to watch the princess die? <laughs> you want to watch Twilight? <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> we know. You're a macho man. You're a macho man. All right, enough. Get off my baby. <laughs> Twilight's good. What do you guys want for Christmas? I probably want just like a nice lounge wear, like a sweatpants and a sweater set. Something that's comfy and cute that I can wear around the house. Cause I don't really have those cute sweat. <laughs> I feel like I have everything that I want. Except for a Lamborghini. Except for a Lamborghini. <laughs> I'd like to rob Guitar Center. You want to rob Guitar Center? Yes. <gasps> Respectfully. <laughs> of course. I wouldn't imagine you doing it any other way. <laughs> Excuse me, can I walk? <laughs> exactly. Can I can I just take this guitar and walk out the door, please? please? And then when Lexi's arrested, sorry. <laughs> they said I could. Okay, go ahead, Ange. What do you want? A life. <laughs> Dream superpower. I want to have what the Cullens have. And that is vitality, money. I guess just being a vampire in general. And shine like diamonds. <laughs> That's right. And just live forever. Dream superpower, everybody. Pick one dream superpower. I mean, mine's the same as yours. Really? Okay. Okay, so we on the same page. What about you? To have a cloak of <sighs> invisibility. Okay, Harry Potter nerd. <laughs> I want to turn invisible, like, control it. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. What about you? Same thing. Fave musical artist, movie, and music genre. Okay, go ahead, Lex. Oh, we don't even have to ask you. We already know. So says his shrine upstairs in his room. It's not a shrine. <laughs> <laughs> Lex has an MC. It's a collection. It's not a shrine, it's a collection. Lex has an MCR shrine. It's a collection. Okay, sweetie, it's all right. Fave movie? Oh, I'm dress. Okay. And music genre, obviously. MCR. Oh, that's the genre itself. Huh? It is now. Okay, my favorite musical artist is... Gosh, that's a tough one. Beyonce. Britney Spears. <laughs> they know me well. Okay, so movie. Mm, Clueless. Mean Girls. Cinderella Story. Oh, Freaky Friday. Uh, R&B and Rap. And Back to the Future is my favorite Sing movie. us your favorite song. All the... Oh, wait, that's not it. I guess I like rock too. I like all genres. I do. I will listen to Tchaikovsky classical music. I will listen to elevator coffee table jazz. I will listen to country music. Yeah. I will listen to hip hop. I will listen to uh, pop. I, basically a lot of stuff. We're well I love everything. Yeah. Hardcore death metal. Except for I have not country. Got we into don't have that country yet, set. But I will, I'm open to it. We don't I'm have, open to it. We don't have country set. On our I radio. have a country playlist on my oh. the Apple Music. Go ahead, Ange. There's a lot of rock. Okay. 
some indie folk uh, oh. uh, EDM. Uh huh. Dubstep. I see that. Dubstep. Push me. It said this time. Okay. Go ahead. What else? Oh, well, I can't think of right now. Okay. What about movie? Parts of the I knew it. Yes. And she can watch that Classic all game. day, every day. Been, okay. What about musical? What's artists? your favorite line from the movie series? <clears throat> Only that scene where Johnny Depp is dancing with that jar of dirt. And what is this? Like, what's the line? When he was walking around with alcohol, being drunk. Oh wait, there's that too. Uh oh. However, do we you pick? Know what? There's that one. Why is the rum gone? Oh, classic Ange. Classic. Yeah. She cannot wait until she can get her hands on her first Captain Morgan. But why is the rum gone? Arthur. Yeah. Why is Let the me rum tell you something, gone? guys. I bought Chris a bottle <laughs> and it's safe for his birthday. And what happened? We said I wasn't drinking it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I didn't have that much. The entire container. <laughs> I believe you, Ange. I believe you. It's okay. So, so that let's was, not address the fact that you're not 21 yet. That was, that <laughs> let's was just a, leave that out of there. That was a prank. Just kidding, guys. Right? Wink. Yeah. Just kidding. Okay, so, um, do you guys do any Filipino traditions? <clears throat> oh god, it burns. <clears throat> what are you talking about? My nose. Burp. The carbonation. You guys do Filipino traditions? Like what? Um, we eat Filipino food. <laughs> we like to go to Seafood City and get snacks. Is that a tradition? I like looking at all the fish on the ice. I mean, we're talking <laughs> like we're talking traditions, so I would say. What's a Filipino tradition? We go to church on. Lights on, lights on, lights on at tradition. Christmas. <laughs> that is a tradition. But we don't do that. Let's show. Huh? The only times I had lechon was. Lechon. Lechon. <laughs> lechon, whatever. The only time that I had lechon. In the Philippines. Philippines. In the Philippines, mm -hmm. I ate the lechon. Were you scared of it? I freaked out when I first saw lechon on a stick. Lechon? Lechon is like a pig, a full pig, and they cook it on a steak. And they just oh, turn it over I the fire. I love the skin though, the skin is amazing. It's crispy. Mm. Now that I'm vegan, I'm just sad. Okay, so the last question is going to be something that I personally have for all of you. And that is, how should we celebrate and ring in the new year? Drinking. Opinions, okay, noted. I think we should celebrate. Done. What about you, Chris? I think we should have a dance party and dance until okay. the new year. Sounds good. I say we should bring some of this non-alcoholic champagne, some food, bring it to a car, the car, I think drive up the hill, and then we should sit in the car, eat dinner with our champagne, and just watch the fireworks. Wait, are there fireworks on New Year's? <laughs> That's 4th of July. I don't I mean, know. They had fireworks at Vegas. There's I, the New York mm -hmm. thing that goes, mm. Oh yeah, that, I love watching You know what's cool? New Year's is on a Friday. Nice. So I get Friday off, Saturday, Sunday. So that's three days off. And I think we should write some New Year's resolutions out and we should make a video on what we are thankful for in our experiences of 2020. I think we should throw party, <clears throat> party poppers at people. Yeah, we definitely should reflect and celebrate with some good food, good company, and going out there in the world from the safety of our car, of course. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. We hope that you enjoyed having dinner with us. Let us know if you guys want us to do more sit-down family dinners together with all of you. We will really enjoy that. We absolutely love supporting local restaurants anyway, so it's a win-win. Thank you, Ange, for joining us and uh, being in our video again. Everybody seems to love you. If you guys haven't already joined our DMR Drawing family, go ahead and do so by hitting the notification button down below so that you get notified of all of our cozy Vlogmas videos this month. And also, don't forget to follow us on social media. We'll have all of our links listed right here and down below as well. As always, we love you drawings very much. And we will talk to you later. Love you, darlings. Everyone say love you, darlings. Love you, darlings. Love you, darlings. Bye. Say it, Anne. Mwah. Say love it. you, darlings. Woo. There you go. Yeah. Meet my sister. What did you think when your sister, Christine, got pregnant as a teenager? What do you think? What'd you do? You look different. Taking some Instagram pics of Ange.